Mr. Adams, how is the fair going for you so far as a company? Uh, the fair is excellent for us. We've had uh, quite a few customers come in, quite a few new customers as well, old customers. Um, I would say it's probably one of our better fairs so far. Tell me what you're presenting here. What is the, the highlight? What are the innovations um, when it comes to the extruders that you're presenting? Well, essentially, we make uh, extrusion crossheads. And for us, crossheads are at the very heart of every extrusion line. It's essential for the proper operation. So our crossheads are in areas such as um, energy cables, automotive, medical, irrigation, telecommunications, uh, and so forth. Yeah. But they are made uh, uniquely for the company that orders them? We, we have generic models that fit many different industries, but we also have confidentiality agreements, I should say, with some customers where we make something specifically to their needs, very unique just for them. What would you say, what are the customers needing nowadays? Well, how has the industry changed and what are the customers asking for? I think since the last Messe, uh, two years ago, customers are now coming to us looking more in uh, improvements in fiber optics, improvements in telecommunications, things that allow them to save time, save money, uh, perhaps greater precision as well. Is this something that's hard for you to implement? Um, is it something that, that has changed the company? Uh, no, actually that's a good question because not at all. Um, we, we have a, uh, quite a bit of creativity that we give to our engineering team and that allows them to bring innovations to the table that I don't think other companies really have as much. But those are things that uh, essentially as in our brochures even say it's in our DNA. It's really what we do best. I'd like to thank you very much for your time today and I wish you a great time here in Dusseldorf and also at the fair. So thank you for, thanks so much for taking the time. Thank thanks a lot, Mr. Adams.